What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back for another video. In today's video, I think this is one of the best lightsabers out there. Let's open it up. Check it out. Okay, so that was a pretty bold statement. Best lightsaber out there. Um, me, personally, I think it is. Now, I know when it comes to lightsabers, there's all kinds of lightsabers. I mean, good, bad, I mean, color, I mean, everything you could think of. Every Jedi had a lightsaber. So, your personal lightsaber, that's entirely up to you. But this one here, I am super stoked about this one because I really, truly love the way this thing is. Uh, so I want to be, uh, say a big shout out to End Sabers. Thank you so much for uh, sending this to me. So, as you can see, we got an awesome box. Collection Saber. The back side here. May the force be with you. Very, very cool. Um, I love the packaging and stuff. Spot on, as always. So, uh, nothing, nothing to say about that. Oh, this thing is just going to be wicked, wicked cool. Uh, first things first, you get some white gloves. Look at there, white glove service. Get a nice little aluminum uh, etched plate here in Sabres. Very, very nice. You get some tools, an Allen wrench, and some set screws. You got a power cord here, which I'm going to leave here for now. Uh this actually also comes with a very, very cool acrylic base, which is very nice. Get this pulled out. Very nice. I got some packaging for the, uh, I actually uh, have already taken the Sabre out of its protective packaging, so I can put that there. Whew. Here we go. Oh, we have the dark saber right there oh this thing is so cool um i'm i love the dark saber um out of all the lightsabers and i've got a few and and i love lightsabers you know i don't i mean i don't collect them heavy but i'm starting to get into lightsabers a little bit more um but the dark saber to me i just i loved it uh, uh when i first saw it it just uh yeah just wicked cool so let's put that right there and we got the blade look at this look at the blade <laughs> look how cool that is very very nice all right so i'm gonna get the box and stuff we don't need that no more let's do this uh let's check out the uh this acrylic base here I like the fact that the actual uh, InSaber aluminum logo actually uh, goes inside on, on the uh, base here. Get this protective tape off. I'm going to leave this bottom tape on for now, but uh, very, very cool. Does it machined? Does it fit good? Looks like it may be a little snug. Which snug is what you want. You definitely, oh yeah, that's a, that is a great snug fit. That's the way it needs to be right there. You don't want your, uh, you don't want your saber to uh, come loose, right? Boom. Let's see. Look at that. Can't beat that. That's amazing. We get the little uh, nameplate here. Get that all set up. Sticky backed. There we go. Perfect. Boom. Right there. Got your saber. I mean, come on. It does it doesn't get any better than that. No, it doesn't. Um, let's see, don't need that, don't need that. I would put, 
I'm gonna put the white gloves on. They, I, d- I doubt they'll fit. <laughs> I've, I have yet to get a pair of white gloves with anything that uh, remotely fit my hand. So uh, I'll demonstrate. If you got a big hand like me, yeah, <laughs> that's that's about it right there. So, uh, but hey, it's a nice touch. I like the touch on this. Um, so one of the things when it comes to this saber, and, and again, I've already checked into this because it took me a hot minute to figure this out, but I finally did figure it out. And I want to show you, if you get a dark saber, first things first, you know, you, you gotta, you gotta charge the battery up, right? And, uh, I was looking all over, um, for some kind of external, um, you know, just, I, I never saw it and I was looking at screws and right here on, you got one screw right there. Take your Allen wrench and take this screw out. And you know, this, this right here, I feel is important. This is an important piece of the puzzle. <laughs> I mean, I really believe this is important. All right. Almost there. Take that screw out and right here. Boom. There's your battery. And you got your uh, USB port right there, USB-C port right there. So that's how you actually uh, charge your battery up. All the electronics, everything's right there. You got your, uh, it only goes in one way. So as soon as you actually uh, put it in, I set it on, yep, there we go. Boom, only goes in one way, so you can't mess that part up. Sit there and take your uh, little adapter, put it on the screw. It's keyed, so you can't uh, put it on the wrong way either. And you just tighten that bad boy up. Then we'll talk a little bit about the saber itself. Get this screwed back on. There we go, nice and snug. All right, so first and foremost, the quality of this uh, this saber is, in saber does a great job. But this thing, man, it is, it's got some meat to it. It is heavy, it's got a good feel to it. Um, I am curious though, um, you know, when you see this thing in action and, and this and that, it's definitely can be a two handed, but uh, if you got big hands like me, it's, uh, about one and a half, but it's got some great detail to it. Uh, love everything about this thing so far and, uh, no complaints. You do have some, uh, extra screws in here, some set screws. And the set screws actually are for the actual attachment of the blade itself. So, uh, very, very cool. I dig this thing. That's <laughs> such an amazing piece. All right. Let's get these set screws out right here. And there's actually, uh, if I'm not mistaken, let's pop this off real quick. show you some of this stuff in here. I mean, it's just, uh, I, I love this, this aluminum. It's just so, so well designed, well developed. Um, I can't really find anything to complain about. Um, I, I will show one little thing that I did reach out and talk to InSavers about. Um, and I thought it was interesting. But the uh, but it'll make more sense once I actually get the uh, the saber in place. Another one of these right here, and then this got this little collar right here that comes off. This is the uh, the exciting part. So the saber actually mounts right here. You got four set screws, and you got this this collar here, like so. 
So when you take your actual saber blade, like so, this is this is the part that is very very interesting to me is getting the actual uh, blade saber blade and everything attached. But again, before I put the actual collar on, I want to show you this. It actually goes into place right here like that. You put in your four set screws, but again, you've got your uh, little collar piece here. So I'm going to go ahead and get the blade attached, come back, and then we'll uh, fire this thing up and let's go over some of the specs. All right, we're back. Check this out. How cool is this? I mean, come on. Um, I did want to clear something up uh, when it comes to putting the blade in. So these set screws here, actually, you don't have to take this cover off. I was mistaken. Apologies. Uh, these actually hold the blade in, and you have the two set screws here. Uh, one thing to be very, very careful of when you uh, put the blade in, it has to seat all the way down. So the way I did mine, I actually put it like this pushed it down i put one uh these two set screws in first and then i put these four back in but uh yeah this is uh this is it right here i'm gonna borrow the uh the stand here for a minute just uh put it right there for a minute some of the things i want to talk about uh this thing has tons of colors i think there's 12 different colors uh, you've got the, uh, the blade, which is uh, uh, polycarbonate, very, very, uh, very, very tough blade. Uh, we've got motion sensors, of course. Uh, there's different sound fonts. There's all kinds of ways to customize this thing. It is, it's, it's just really, really cool. Um, if the battery goes in correctly, when you, after you charge it, it'll actually, uh, let you know that it actually is installed properly. Uh, it also comes on, as far as instructions go, you get, you basically get this operational manual here. Uh, basically tells you how to go through all the different fonts and things like that. Um, perfect honest with you. I've got it set. As far as the colors go, uh, I mean, I, I want this thing, it's the dark saber, right? And that's the way I've got it set up for me. But just to let you know, this is actually a very, very good uh, instruction as far as how to actually do things, power it on, adjust the volume, uh, to switch your boot effect, blade effects, all kinds of uh, different things there. They are, six. Uh, the sound effects are 16 set sound font, Luke, Kylo, Obi-Wan, Anakin, Darth Vader, Ben Solo, Ahsoka, Ray, Palpatine, and Leia. Blade colors, nine kinds of blade colors. Red, blue, yellow, green, white ice, blue, pink, lavender, orange. The regular light effects, there's nine sets of those. Ghost, cross, infinite, wave, rainbow, fire, stable, unstable, and pulse. Uh, you have startup effects, there's nine sets of boot effects. Tip, standard, drop, end, uh, fire, movement, uh, drop stack charge background music there's three sets of background sounds uh it takes about two to three hours to charge ah, there's this thing just does a lot of things uh operational manual one button uh lets you know how to adjust the volume all your boot effects blade effects sound fonts and so on there is a lot that goes on with this but like i said earlier it's the dark saber so, uh, yeah, you know, the dark saber. This is the way I'm going to do mine. Uh, I mean, we'll, we'll turn the lights off here in a minute, but uh, there's just so much. This just looks so cool. I do have a little bit of a sound effect, you know. That is so cool. Uh, and again, nothing against like the other colors and things like that. But again, it's the dark saber, right? That's just, I'm, it's just, 
That's the color right there. I mean, it's bright too because I've got the lights on and it is very, it's bright. <laughs> but uh, yeah, guys, this thing is just, I think it's the best lightsaber. I, I, that's, that's just me personally. Uh, I, I just do. I mean, I just, I think this is a, a perfect lightsaber. Um, before I turn the lights off and show you things, and I uh, wanted to uh, talk about one of the things I talked to the company about, which threw me off in the beginning. Um, and then I had some stuff come up uh, that delayed this video. But this this piece right here, this, this metal piece where the set screws go, um, when I first got it and looked at it, I thought I was missing a piece because of this being exposed. And I, I, I don't know, it just threw me for a little bit of a loop, but I reached out to the company, sent pictures to them, talked to them. Uh, N Saber's very, very uh, receptive to my comments. And I just felt like this needed to be finished with some kind of a component that maybe snaps and covers this right there. That's that was just me. It threw me off. That's just uh, that's just me. But so cool. All right, let me get the lights off, and uh, I'll show what it looks like in the dark. doesn't get much better when the, the lights are off. So, uh, yeah, there we go, guys. The dark saber. Yes. And I had to break out the, uh, death watch helmet. I mean, come on. I mean, if you're going to wield the, the dark saber, got to have your, your lid on. Right. So, but, uh, yeah, this is it. Hope you enjoyed the, uh, the video. I'll definitely put links to Insaber and everything in the description of the video. Again, thank you to, uh, to them for sending me this, uh, this dark saber to check out. Uh, really do appreciate it. it. Means a lot to me. And, uh, yeah, I mean, now it's like trying to figure out how to display it. I mean, more than likely this is the way to go for, for me. But, uh, I mean, that, that just looks cool like that too. But, uh, I'll definitely be uh, disassembling it and putting it on the display uh, piece right there. Um, but yeah, this is just just an amazing, amazing piece. Look at there, I fired it back up. <laughs> I mean, it's just, you just want to play with it. That's, I mean, come on. <laughs> but uh seriously in sabers thank you so much i really do appreciate it uh again let me know in the comments let me know what your favorite lightsaber is let me know if you collect lightsabers you know i mean again i appreciate lightsabers but this one this one is is cool and that's it just is i'm sorry it's the it's the dark sabers mandalorian come on rule mandalore right so uh but yeah, I want to hear. I want to hear what your favorite lightsaber is. So definitely leave it in the comments. Also, if this is your first time on my channel, if you enjoy this video or videos that I make uh, or just my content in general, do me a favor. Consider hitting that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, make sure to turn notifications on. That way, you'll know when I drop videos and do live streams and pretty much everything else. If you like this video, give me a like on it. I'd really appreciate that as well. And finally, please. Always remember, lightsabers 
refreshes your soul, and I'll see you next time.